Hello, everybody. Welcome back to LSPDFR once again. My name is Jeff Fabiano, and we are doing a patrol out on the highways of San Andreas with this awesome expedition uh, that we got going here today. I'll have a link for the truck in the description below if you want to check it out. And uh, this is the lighting package we got on it is a scan pattern by default. So I'm just going to stick with that. But uh, for now, we're just going to kind of roll down uh, Route 68 and uh, see what happens. Dispatch to any available central unit. A plane emergency, report. Great Ocean uh, Highway, respond code 3. Emergency. Respond code 3. Okay. Great Ocean Highway. One link in 18, show me in route. Let's do Car it. David, 22. Code Whoa, three. explosion. Right out of the gate, something crazy here. Plane emergency, plane signaled a serious emergency, respond code 3. What's we're doing right now uh, towards Great Ocean Highway. You press I to switch the camera. Or L, is it L? Nope, not L. I think it's I, but it's not seeming to work right now, but that's okay. We're still going to be heading this direction and looks like it's uh, approaching from the south, uh, going north right now. Check out the uh, interior of this thing too, man. It is a solid, uh, solid expedition. I like it a lot. Let's get around this corner here at high speeds. Not a lot of traffic on the roads right now. That's kind of nice. And maybe they do that for this call out. I don't know. But it's very strange to not see any cars on the road right here, right now. I don't know where the plane is, but we're trying to get out here as soon as we possibly can. Oh, there's a little bit of somebody there. Don't mind me, dude. Just, you know, heading to a plane emergency. Is it circling? It might be. Um, I'm not going to hit the... I hit the I key. It's not doing anything, but that's okay. Maybe it's shift I. Maybe. Let's get a little bit closer. Maybe we have to have eyes on the plane, you know? Some scripts work that way. Yeah, not any traffic in the area. So perhaps they have already cleared the roads. Um, although that guy's in a, on his bike there. But this expedition gets up and goes, doesn't it? The nice thing is we can uh, apex these corners. Oh, there's the plane on the uh, map, but I don't see the plane itself. What is it doing? Car four, David, 22. Oh, last data David, interrogation five, received. Crew count one, main engine A1 requires immediate fire extinguishment. Passing vehicle data to all units in the area. You're a manufacturer. Okay, there you go. Okay, so now the plane is... I don't see it. I hear it, though. Hit I. Oh, there it is. Check it out. And it's trying to make a uh, approach onto... There it is right there in front of us. And it looks like it's a... Is that a... It might be a Mamatis. No, that's not a Mamatis. It's a, uh, I think that's the manufacturer. I can't remember in GTA lore which airplane that is. I can't see anything here, but let's have a look. He's still just approaching. What? Oh, yeah, they got the road shut down here, man. One Lincoln 18 on scene. Wow, he's making the turn. He's, oh, my God. He did it. He did it. <laughs> wow. What an incredible job. They lived it. Oh, he fell. Wait for the first responders to arrive. All right. Okay, he's running away from the plane. It could catch on fire. They said they had an engine issue. So that could be the case here. Dude, you okay? All right. Fire truck's on the way. And we need to talk to the pilot. Yes, sir. All right. Don't mind me. Don't mind me at all here. Holy moly. Mosca Choli, they're getting crazy. You guys are fine. Put your guns away. We got to go talk to this guy. There's the ambulance on scene. Let's go talk to the pilot. Hey, dude, you okay? What's up? You okay? He's saying what? Not a lot to us. He, I mean, he's saying something to us, but I just don't know what it is. Dude, you're lucky to be alive. I'll tell you that right now. Oh, yeah, I can't hear anything. We're just having a conversation with them, it looks like, at this moment. Another ambulance on scene here. And fire crew is clear. He, uh, he landed the plane safely. That was crazy, dude. Okay, he's still talking to me. I can't uh, hear anything he's saying. Um, all right, cool, dude. Thank you. So I think that's all we had to do. We have to wait for the uh, rescue crew here to talk to him. That's what it's looking like because they're walking up to him. What's going on, guys? Great job blocking the road and everything. Oof. They did an awesome job on this call. This is a neat call out, though. Why'd we even show up? I, uh, I I get it, man. But, I mean, a guy thought he was going to die trying to land this plane, and and he's good to go. 
I don't think I can say anything further to you, dude. Nope, he's just going to sit there and uh, chat with me like this. His hands are shaking. Narcotic intoxication, possibly, here on a Vince Miller. Driver license suspended. He's an outstanding warrant. Yet you don't look like a, you know, like a private corporate pilot to me. Um, I don't know what's going on. Like, did this dude steal this plane and didn't know what he was doing? That's very possible. Um, all right, dude. Well, the problem is, uh, dispatch is telling me right now that, uh, you got an outstanding warrant, dude. In true LSPDFR fashion, everybody's a criminal. Look at that Titan taking off. Looks amazing. All right, man. Anything illegal on you I should know about? I'm going to pat you down for weapons. I just don't get the whole shebang here. Don't hit my truck, please, and thank you. All right. Pack of gum, matches, pocket knife, and inhaler in Ped's name. They're coming over here to check him again. Guys, I got him in cuffs. What is your problem? His pupils are dilated, too. That's not a good thing. Man, a lot of activity at Zancudo today. So we're going to walk him back over here. They're trying to run me over. Um, and we're going to do a field sobriety test on him, see if he's been impaired by some sort of substance. Uh, and then we're going to check the airplane out as well. Not sure if this is how the uh, call out's supposed to go, but uh, that's what I'm doing. Why are your pupils so dilated, dude? They're just sensitive to light. Okay, I got gotcha. you. Your hands seem to be shaking a lot. I know you just went through something. My nervous system is shot. Yep, I totally understand, man. I'm just making sure that uh, you aren't uh, drinking or anything. You under the influence of anything? Show me some proof then. Okay, gotcha. You. No problem. I'm going to run some sobriety tests, okay? We're going to try to figure out uh, how this goes. How can you test me on something I didn't study for? So I don't have the option to do a FST on him right now, so I'm just going to go ahead and do the breathalyzer. I know that's not the right way to do it, but that's just an LSPDFR kind of thing, uh, depending on how you have them cuffed early on Thanks. and all of that. So let's just see what we got here. He's clear on that, okay, but he's got a warrant. Let's find out what's going on with this dude. Vince Miller is his name, and he's got a suspended license, arrest warrant for assault on an LEO with a deadly weapon. Wow. Okay. Knowingly providing false information, soliciting prostitution, pros uh, possession of firearm with modified serial number. So this isn't his first rodeo, that's for certain. So assault on an LEO with deadly weapon is his charge that that is all about. So we will find out what's going on with that in the court. I mean, dude, insane that this guy is such a criminal uh, and he doesn't seem like he's a corporate pilot at all, but he's got a court case for that right now. Um, we're going to go ahead and get him transported for his warrant. Uh, what are you doing, dude? And then we are going to go ahead and uh, see what we can do here with the airplane. On, um, Although they're just crashing into it right now. Highway. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. Hey, settle down, dude. That was awesome, though. The plane uh, and making that approach was nuts, number one. But number two, like, he landed it like a boss. Can we search the, the airplane? Let's try. We're definitely going to try. See if there's anything illegal in there that uh, we can find that would put backpack full of drug paraphernalia. Uh-oh, and an ounce of baggie of white powder. There it is. Let's check the uh, white powder here. He had all the paraphernalia, so he's going to get a charge on that. But let's see if this is cocaine, and maybe that's what he was smuggling or trying to smuggle out of Los Santos. Perhaps. Negative on that one. Okay. Heroin. We're going to keep uh, trying different ones here. It might be PCP or something. Uh, let's see. PCP. Could be a powder form of PCP, but regardless, maybe it's going to Kyle Perico. Who knows? Nothing there. All right. Cool. Fentanyl. We're going to need the mandolin reagent next and see if that's the case. Nope. So it's probably meth. Let's see. And it's meth. <laughs> and meth. Oh, man. Well, those are two more charges on him. Possession of methamphetamine. There we go. And then it's going to be narcotics. Uh, possession of drug paraphernalia. Those are the two charges we got there. And we will submit those charges. Now, um, we are going to get a blood sample from him and see if he was under the influence at all. Uh, but they're taking him away. So we're not going to worry about that one right now. Those are the main charges he's dealing with right now. One Lincoln 18. Show me code 4. We'll be all finished here. Attention all units. Code 4. No further gates wow. required. Just absolutely crazy right out of the gate. And the sun's already going down, man. All units. Suspect Strange people on Great Ocean Highway. Great Ocean Highway. All right. We're right around the corner. I mean, we can go check it out. Let's go down and turn around here. Yeah, they had the traffic completely. An alien sighting. Caller claims that the subjects are aliens. 
the code two response. So we're just going to go see what's going on with this. But I mean, it's not aliens, man. It's it's this guy that just landed a plane next to us. So there's that. And that's not cleaning up very well, that uh, script. I'm kind of worried with that call out. I'm worried that it might cause a crash because of it. All right, we're going to be on scene. Oh, there we go. One looking 18, show me on scene. Um, what is this? Acknowledged. One Lincoln 18. Proceed with caution. One Lincoln 18. Request code three backup. And we're also going to ask for uh, some other backup, backup too. On Great Ocean Highway. Get a noose unit over here, man. Charlie four. Roger that. We're in the area. And a SWAT. Uh, they look like they might have weapons or something. Like, I don't know. Ocean one, we can get that. Explosions at Zancudo. All right, we're gonna find out what's happening here. I don't know what this is. This is <laughs> this is ridiculous. All right, let's grab our rifle from this. We don't know what these guys are capable of. I think they're in uh, alien masks and suits right now, man. But this is Zancudo, so you never know. You never know. So let's see. We have an alien invasion or what's happening here, but they've got that uh, a certain thing on there. I don't like not having cover. All right, here, guys. I'm going to move my truck up, and we're going to use it as cover, okay? Let's do that because we have no cover, and this expedition is pretty darn big, so let's move up on them a little bit here. And they're freaking out. They're freaking out. They're freaking out. They're coming after me. Oh, my God. They just went. What was that? They're gone. They're gone. Into the sky. Just like that, dude. Um. Yeah. I don't think, guys, I think this is a, uh, a Zancudo issue at this point in the Air Force. Uh, I don't think we were supposed to see any of this, but we were first on scene. So we're just going to chalk it up to that. Um. So I got to say, I think the caller was correct. I, I, I don't think that they were crazy. Uh, even a little bit right there. So we're good on the backup and we're going to store a rifle. But wow, I, I, now I can say I've seen it all in uh, LSPD far and this is no exception. So we're just going to go ahead and uh, give it over to the Air Force. I'm sure they're going to release a statement saying it was a weather balloon or something like that. And then we're going to be uh, all finished here and back uh, on patrol. Attention all units and aircraft, what an aircraft crash. What is going and on today? Code Get to the crash site as soon as you can. Oh my god, I heard the explosion. Uh, one Lincoln 18, show me in route. Wow. Ten four copy. One Lincoln 18. I know the roads back here are a little bit better than uh, going the other way, so we're gonna get there a lot quicker if we do it this way. Look, like it's on the other side. I don't know what kind of airplane crashed, but boy, planes are just falling out of the sky today, aren't they? They certainly are. So we're going to see what's going on here with this. Using this expedition, man, for uh, what it's designed for, some off-road action. Down the corner we go. Woo! Steps out a little bit there. Oh, I love the strobing lights on this package. This looks awesome. Ooh, slow down here. I'm going to go ahead and kill my siren. Who are we kidding? Uh, we're going to have eyes on the problem here in a second. It looks like it's at the Redwood Lights track. So maybe it would have been better to go the other way, but you know what? Any opportunity we get to go off-road, we're going to take it, especially in a truck like this. So that's what I plan on doing here. We need to get on scene and assess the situation. Come down here. Ooh, this thing really gets up and goes using the baller two handling line. So that's where that acceleration's coming from. All right. It's going to be at the Redwood Lights track. I have, n I don't see a fire or anything like that, but we're first on scene here. Oh, my God. There it is right there. It's another business jet. One Lincoln 18. Show me on scene. What is going on? One Lincoln 18. I have to proceed climb with this thing. Yeah, we're going to proceed with caution. Oh, my God. Secondary explosions. One Lincoln 18. Request fire department. Wow. Required in, Hang in there, guys. Uh, the Redwood Light Hang in track. there. We got a big fire happening right here, right now. Let's go ahead and we're gonna try to get this guy away from the. Uh, I'm gonna get him away from the from the airplane, guys. Thank you. Come on. Go this way. 
All right, I'm pulling this guy away. He looks like an air unit pilot is what he looks like. This one's going to be tough. All right, just stay right there, dude. Stay right there. They're tending to do the other guy right now. They got the fire out immediately. Hang in there, man. What's your name? My name is uh, Trooper Faviano with the San Andreas Iowa Patrol. You're going to be okay, man. You were just in a, uh, a pretty bad crash. I don't know why they're monster trucking your plane. Don't ask me. But they're trying to monster truck right over the top of that thing. They're DOA. Okay. What about this guy? Oh, my God. He's really trying to get over that airplane right now. And that other one is too. All right. He's going to be okay. He's going to be okay. Holy moly, man. Well, we can't figure out what's going on. These guys are nuts. He's, okay, he figured his life out, and uh, I think the uh, aliens took care of him, so that's good. This guy is no good. We're going to need a corner down here. That thing is still sparking like crazy. They didn't even do a good job uh, at all. Actually, you know what? One Lincoln 18 request corner unit. Wow. Assistance required. Dude, can you just not run the siren the entire time? Okay, he figured his life out. This one has not. Wow, dude. Just a huge airplane crash, but this guy's lucky to be alive. That guy, unfortunately, did not make it. So we're going to go ahead and uh, tell them that we're going to be leaving after this is clear. Everything's under control right now. We're going to be leaving the scene. We got corner and route. There's the corner. Just went through the through the fence line and uh, off-roaded it straight over. Oh, he's working on him now. That may not be the case. Um, I'm not sure. You all right, man? Okay, he's he's giving CPR on them right now. We have the corn. Yeah, they th yeah, they already tried. Yeah, there's nothing you could do. They already tried, and corner is just kind of confused right now. All right, another ambulance is showing up, and they're trying to figure out where people are. Yeah, they're deceased now. Now we know the patient reports struck by an explosion. I would absolutely concur with that one. Wow, look at the lighting right now. That looks amazing. Absolutely incredible. All right, so we're going to be clear on this call. I'm going to let her know. Well, we already did let her know, actually. But we'll be back on patrol. You know, as I'm leaving the scene here, check it out, man. The uh, attention to detail on the lighting in the front, man. Those look great. The headlights on this thing, that looks like a proper expedition headlight. Very nice. We okay, have we got a, a race car. On, uh, what the heck the is that? Freeway. Okay. Dispatch, we have a visual. You have a visual? It's on the other side, it looks like. You know what? I'm going to turn around right here, actually. Perfect time to turn around. Looks like it's right here. They said it's a race car. Animals running loose on foot. Animals running loose on foot. That's not a... Oh, my God. He just got wrecked. Stop right there. LSB, you got nowhere to run. Tase him, dude. Tase him. I'm going to go around the other way. Usually, if you do this, they like to bail the other way, but we have that big bull... Bar. Oh, there he is right here. Hey, stop running, dude. Come here, you. This is LSPD. It is the LSPD. And uh, this is the, well, we're not. They're the troopers, but, you know, there's that. We're going to tase this dude if we can. We're going to have speed on him. Come on, man. I don't know why this guy isn't tasing him to stop him. He's going to run into LSPD. traffic and get hit. Enough. He's being an idiot. We're running uh, now towards Ron Alternate's farm. Freeze. We're going to be Make on the uh, northbound lanes of the 15. Right into the truck right there. This guy's uh, yelling commands at him. He's not stopping. I caught up to him. Tasing him. You idiot. Stay right there, dude. He's, don't run again. Stay right where we can see you. I got you uh, covered, man, if you want to go in for the arrest on him. Yeah, he's not going anywhere. Right there's fine. I'm going to go ahead and change over to my other gun so I can put the flashlight on him here. All right. Let's see what's going on. You're under arrest, dumbass. Yeah, he is. So it was not a race car. It was a uh, Infernus, but this is their pursuit. We were just helping out with that. So I'm not even going to be dealing with him. It's uh, it's theirs, and uh, they're code four on it. So we will be too. We have a Grand Theft Auto in progress. Grand Theft Auto in progress on, uh, right here. Sonora Freeway. One Lincoln 18, show me in route. Okay. Copy that. One Trying Lincoln to arrest 18. the criminal. Is it behind us? Is it this vehicle right here on the right? What is this? Is this? Oh my God! He's. Oh yeah, we got him. One like an 18. I'm in pursuit. Wow. Okay. He's fleeing from us, but okay. One Lincoln 18. Show me in pursuit. 
Not sure if that was the right terminology, but yes, there it goes. All right. So he's uh, taking off on us right now, not stopping at all. We're heading uh, right now towards Union Road here, northbound 13 lanes. And he's kind of like all over the place here, so we're sticking with him right now. One Lincoln 18 request pursuit backup. We'll get pursuit backup, and we'll get an air unit out here as well, if that'll work. Didn't look like that one worked, so we're going to do local on you. There we go. Make sure tactics are on, off um, so they don't try way. stupid stuff on us here. There's the other unit. Bobcat 4, we're in route. Bobcat 4, we're we in route. One Lincoln 18 request air support. Dispatch air unit over Mount Gordo. All right, so they're coming out of Mount Gordo right now. This guy is doing over. some weird stuff. Suspect is heading north. My pursuit backup was garbage, so we'll try them again if we can. Backup needed on. Um, I think they spawned the in the mountains. Right? That's what it looked like. They spawned in, in the mountains. Victor 13, <laughs> currently heading to the location. Victor 13, you were up on the mountain. What are you talking about? You're, there's no way in heck you're going to be able to get here. Let's try a couple more. There we go. Maybe Back they'll spawn ahead of us here. Sonora there they are on the left side. Dispatch, we got a visual on the perp. Oh, it's Park Ranger. I did change out the Park Ranger vehicle because I want to do a Park Ranger patrol. And they got Tahoe. Look at that. Yeah, Tahoe. Looks good. Why would you go in the middle there and be an idiot? All right. We're going to put a stop to this guy. One Lincoln 18 request pit maneuver. Unit, right. Lincoln 18. Move in and mobilize suspect's vehicle. We're going to go ahead and perform a pit, pit maneuver on this vehicle. On the There's the pit right there. Pit was successful. And there they are rolling up on him. Hands where we can see him, dude. Hands where we can see him. Stay right there. All the way to the ground, man. All the way to the ground. I got you covered. Whoa. They just smoked that bison. That took no time at all. Stay right there, man. All right, we got him in custody right now. Awesome, let's get the uh, road closed down. Stop the traffic in the air so we don't die. All right. All right, ma'am. What's that about, huh? Just not stopping for us today? You have anything illegal on you, man? He's gonna he's gonna be checking you. Better just let me know now. Uh, and he's got a lot of dollar bills, set of car key blanks, and one gram of baggie of white powder. Interesting, okay. Anything illegal in the car? We're going to run the car and all that stuff, too. What's your name? Eric uh, Stewart? Okay. Good day, Eric Stewart. He's going to be valid and clear on his warrants. Okay. I'm just going to try to figure out what. why were you running, man? That's what I don't understand. Let's go ahead and get the uh, plate checked. It's 29 Nora Boy David 179. Target vehicle license plate. Two Megan Niners Clegg. Nora Boy That's not Megan David Clegg. 179ers. Target is 10-4. All right, they're going to be 10-4 on that. So they're off to the side of the road. I'm going to go ahead and get tow for this. One Lincoln 18, request tow. And uh, we can get this thing out of here, basically. Yeah, he's on okay. the side. Required I'm going to move this um, to the side of the road Great so we're not holding everybody up here right now. You know what I mean? So let's go ahead and uh, we're going to move you a little bit further to the side here, buddy. I'm going to move my car over here as well. So hang out right here. And uh, I'm going to have you actually uh, set down on the ground. There we go. Get my car out of here so we can open traffic once the tow truck gets here on scene, which they're trying to do right now by blitzing through everybody. But that's all right. We're just going to go ahead and uh, clear it anyway. And that should get everything back to normal. Hopefully. Get the traffic control. There we go. So Megan Clegg is the... R O. I don't believe that's them because that's Eric Stewart we have here. So uh, they're the owner of the vehicle. So that doesn't mean that it is stolen by any means because we would have flags in here if that were the case. But Eric Stewart is the guy that we have here in custody right now. Uh, and he's got priors for littering, expired driver license. Uh, but uh, right now you can see it's valid. He has no warrants, nothing like that. So it doesn't make sense why other than the drugs. So we're going to go ahead and uh, find out what those are. I checked all of the reagent tests, so it's just white powder. It's not a drug charge on him. So I don't know what you're running for, man, but 
now you got uh, problems of uh, fleeing and eluding. That's the only charge he has right now. So attempt to elude LEO is what he had. He didn't do anything crazy to hit anybody or do anything stupid. So that's what he's got going on for him. And uh, all right, it is time for the court cases. You know them. You love them. Let's see what happened with Vince Miller and Eric Stewart today. All right, in the case, that was an assault on an LEO with deadly weapon, his warrant. He successfully landed an airplane on Great Ocean Highway. Very cool, but he's fined $1,372, three years in prison for that warrant. And then we had possession of drug paraphernalia and possession of meth. Not guilty of the drug paraphernalia, so that's not what was in the bag. But he was fined $347 and one year in prison for the meth which is not good. Eric Stewart right here. Um, he had one, yeah, one fine, which was $838. License suspended for 19 months, one year in prison for just attempting to elude LEO over a white baggie, uh, or sorry, a baggie of white powder that just didn't make any sense. All right, folks, that's going to do it for this episode of LSPDFR. Let me know what you thought of it in the comments below. Awesome call outs for sure today. Uh, really enjoyed those. It was crazy, but I'll see you guys next time. Take care.